Dear God, I trust you, Lord and Father. I'm tired, I'm drained, and not feeling great today. I don't see an ending or a new beginning. I've been begging you. I want things to change. I'm sad and I hate my current situation. This job is taking everything and every ounce of joy from me. Please, Lord, release me from this hold. I want to be able to take care of my bills in addition to living life instead of surviving. I'm waiting on your call, Lord. I'm releasing anything not for me and not entertaining things unlike you and unlike me. I hate this job. It is so unfair. I don't understand life. I worked so hard. I sacrificed over and over again. I'm being negative today. Yeah, I'm being negative today. Today is not a beautiful day. I'm angry. I'm tired. I just don't know. I need you, Lord. Please open the doors. I need you, Lord. Please send me a yes. Please save me from this hell. My mind is killing me. My thoughts have me trapped. Maybe today is just a bad day for me. I'm sorry, Lord. Thank you, God. I say that to say this. I'm being vulnerable with you guys because I want you to know that you're not alone. On our spiritual journey, we will encounter feelings of defeat. Um, we will question the Lord. We will we will question faith. Um, sometimes it just becomes too much and we crash. And on April 17th, 2023, I crashed. Um, I feel like I didn't have any hope. I was begging God. I was on my knees. I, I was telling him I sacrificed. Lord, I did it. I, I worked hard. I put in the hours. Where is my reward? I'm begging to ask God, and I want to leave you guys with this. Faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. Sometimes we walk around saying that we have faith. You don't have faith. If you're questioning God, you don't have faith. If you already did a prayer and you're praying again and you're stressing yourself out every single night about the same thing, worried that it's not going to come, you don't have faith. You have to believe it even though you can't see it. You have to trust them even when you can't hear them. You have to keep going even when you want to give up. That's true faith. That's Hebrews 11. 1. You have to believe. You guys have to believe. So, I love you guys so much. And please, just keep having faith in God. Your situation is going to turn around. Practice gratitude. Be thankful for the things that you have. Take care of the things that you have. You woke up today, it's a blessing. And listen to God. Don't move without him. Ask God, God, is this, is this something you want me to do? God, should I be applying for this job? God, should I go here? What's the next move for me, Lord? Until God tell you to move, be still. I love you guys so much. God bless you.